friends and welcome back to my channel today we are going to be doing a lot in this video we are going to be getting it all done we are going to be doing a lot of cleaning a lot of different things around the house and then we are also going to be going vacation shopping and getting a few things and i show a vacation haul as well but just a lot of different things in this video on vacation very soon and I cannot stand to leave my house dirty and so this weekend I wanted to go ahead and get as much done as I can to help my week go smoother and not have to do so much and just being able to have Ethan home where I can get a lot done as well I knew I wanted to get the girls rooms picked up really well I wanted to mop the house really well and just get as much done as I can just to make my week just go better so I'm starting off in my bedroom making up my bed I should have washed my sheets this morning and decided not to I'll do that probably early on in the week Week. then I'm getting some laundry done as well thrive when my home is picked up and I know it's nice and neat and it does not stay this way like very often but I do go to bed each night just making sure the house is picked up pretty well dishes are done the kitchen's picked up and the living room's picked up is my main priority each day and then when I can I try to go and get a better deep cleaning in some areas the girls rooms when needed they do pick up their rooms but then sometimes mom needs to get in there and do some things as well um, but anyways, I am doing some laundry, putting up my laundry, and I really need to get in this closet. It's not super unorganized, but I could get in here and do a few more things to it. Um, anyways, just putting up laundry and getting everything else done. get our shower door ordered we wanted to get a few different quotes before we decided which company we were going with but we finally decided on it and went ahead and got everything ordered and got them to go ahead and get us in the book so three to four weeks it should be here and we are really excited for it to be completely finished we are actually able to use it um now but just because the shower so big it don't make a big mess in the floor but it's gonna be really nice when we actually get our door we're pretty excited for it Robo Rock for sponsoring today's video. Y'all have heard me talk about Robo Rock before. We love our Robo robot vacuum cleaner from them and I just recently got the cordless vacuum from them. It is brand new and I am so excited to share this with y'all. This is the Roborock H7. You see it how we have it stored. We actually have it stored um, in our laundry room. It's the best place set for it but it is magnetic so all of the tools that it comes with. It comes with several different tools is magnetic and you just stick it on there. It's super super convenient has a large dust bin so you don't have to empty it as often and you can also there's also dust bin bags as well for it one of my favorite features is the display on it you there's a child lock that you just saw and then there's different modes on there for suction power and then whenever you're using it it will tell you how much time left so it can get up to 90 minutes on like an eco mode but it just really depends on which mode you have it on but i can do my entire house so easily and still have plenty of time left it is super lightweight as you can tell i have no trouble i think it's like a little over three pounds super super lightweight but it is the suction is wonderful i've never ever i've had other uh, vacuum cleaners in the past cordless vacs and this one by far beats every other one that i've ever had but 
I am cleaning it right here. I'm emptying it and it also has a reusable filter that you can clean and reuse it and just wash it and reuse it. So I have already emptied it, but I want to show y'all just how powerful the suction is. I'm getting ready to do my rug, which I do this pretty much every single day. And every time I do it, I get so much out of my rug each time. That just shows you how dirty it gets and how much gets into my rug. It is so powerful. And so I want to show y'all here in just a couple minutes when it's once I'm done cleaning the rug, how much dirt is in there. If y'all are interested in the Roborock H7, I truly, it is truly the best one I have ever used. I'm going to leave a link below and you guys can go check it out. And this is what was after I cleaned my rug. Paused my cleaning. We are, Ethan and I are heading out with Callan. We are actually getting ready to drop the girls off for a little bit for the evening, just for the evening. We are actually headed on vacation soon and we need to do some vacation shopping. So um, I thought I'll bring y'all along for that as um, we go find some stuff maybe for the kids, for myself. I feel like I just wear the same thing every single day because I feel like I just have nothing that I feel comfortable in. And so I was maybe hoping to find me a few things, but we are going shopping and I thought y'all could come along for that and then we will pick back up with um, getting some more things done tomorrow. But we are dropping the girls off and heading and doing a little bit of shopping. We are in Old Navy. They have like, I'm gonna try this dress on. I'm gonna grab these but it's hard to find anything because I've got to have some like nursing friendly things that I can easily nurse when we're out. And it's hard to find stuff like that, but I'm gonna look at some of the kids stuff. It's cute. Some of the kids dresses and clothes. Callan just ate in the car before we came in. Huh? <laughs> He's starting to chew on his hands a lot lately. These are super cute. $15. I really like those. Look at the rim size. And then Delaney size. That's cute. That'd be really cute for pictures. The Callan is starting to get into three to six months. So I'm gonna have to start buying him some bigger size stuff. Some bigger size clothes. That's what I'm looking for for him. Some three to six. So Old Navy was a bust. I got those sandals, those slip-on. Um, I thought those would be really good for like casual wear or like wear to the pool and stuff, the beach, because um, just the material they're made of. But it is such a struggle to find nursing friendly things. Like things that I can pull down. Like this dress is so perfect because I can pull it down. It's stretchy. Or it's just really tough and I love to wear dresses at this point just because I like how comfortable I am in them and they're like flowy and um, so dresses right now are just really comfortable for me but it's just really tough to find things that I can easily nurse him in if we're out if we're eating and I don't want to you know have to pull a dress completely up or any shirt would work, but I'm really more so looking for like comfy things like dresses. I just love to wear dresses and stuff just to be comfortable. One more step. <laughs> All right, found a couple things. Now I'm gonna see what kind of little boys' clothes they have. Let's see. Well, that they have in his size. I'm gonna be cute for the beach little whales which he's got something similar with whales on it what about that you like that pink <laughs> that's kind of cute kind of like that when they do that one how much 9.99 little rompers i love rompers that'd be perfect you might need a bigger size than that that looks small don't it is that a whale that's a shark what is that shark he might actually need, man, I hate to say he needs six months, but that looks kind of small. Let's see. Nine to 12 pounds. I think he's probably 12 pounds. Maybe they have a bigger size. Okay, I really like this. 
that cute? So it over the beach, spent that one too. I think we'll do that one. Here, babe, do you like this? Mm -hmm. Isn't that cute? <laughs> I think these colors are really pretty. Those color shorts, but we don't really need any. Just a few things. And then a lot of times I get his clothes off of like oldnavy.com and Gap. So I'll probably just place an order soon for those. This one's really cute, like dressier. Alright, before I jump in the shower and get undressed for the day, I thought I'd give y'all a haul from Ulta. Old Navy, well, I, I, I got something from each of these places. Ulta, Old Navy, TJ Maxx, and Target. I only got a couple things, except besides Target. I got a few things from there. But from TJ Maxx, I actually get ready to order some more of this on Amazon because I've not been able to find it at my local Marshalls. And they had one bottle at TJ Maxx. They had a ton of regular vanilla, but the vanilla caramel cream is so good. And it's $3.99 if you get it from like TJ Maxx or Marshalls, but on Amazon it's $9.99. So I'm so glad I found it and did not order it on Amazon. And then lastly for Marshalls, I just got two little things from there. Um, I got some nail polish. This OPI Arigato from Tokyo is what it's called. So I thought that was a pretty color. Um, and then from Ulta, I needed some new makeup. So I'm gonna try this It Cosmetics Bye Bye Foundation Full Coverage Moisturizer. It's got SPF 50 in it. I'm not sure if it's my right shade. I hope it is. If not, then I can bring it back to Ulta. But I am excited to try it. Um, I've heard good things about it, but I really, hopefully that'll be good. I really needed some more foundation, so went ahead and picked that up. And then my favorite under eye uh, powder, the Essence Brighten Up Banana Powder. That's the only two things I got from Ulta. Um, basically just things that I just really needed. And that I did end up getting these really cute, these really cute sandals. Um, they are so, they're gonna be so perfect for just around the house, outside playing at the beach, going to the pool and things like that. And then from Target, I ended up getting me some shorts. How cute are those? They're like um, paper bag shorts, is that what you call them? Um, the brand is Knox Rose. They are really cute though. I did grab those. And then I ended up getting just a plain black t-shirt because I do not have a plain black t-shirt and I have it. I needed this for a couple different things. So just a plain black tee. I'm not going to show it, but I did get a new nursing bra. I needed a different size in that. So I picked one of those up. Ethan got some body wash. Um, for Millie, I did get her this tank top and I got Rian the exact same one. Also for Millie and Rian, I got them these little skorts. Has the shorts underneath them for both of the, Millie and Rian, I got both those. For Millie, I got her these shorts. I thought those were cute and they are like denim. I didn't get Rian the same ones cause she's really picky about um, comfort. So I got her some different ones. I think they're in a different bag. And then um, actually here they are. These are more stretchy, more her style. Um, and then me, uh, Delaney and Rihanna got them a new like Sunday dress. Thought they could wear that and do this Sunday to church. I thought it was really cute and a really pretty color. And Millie has a like striped dress that I believe has this color in it. Um, so, and then I got Delaney a new denim skirt. She's been wanting a new denim skirt for church. So I grabbed her one of those. It's a good length. And then just a couple things for Callan. I did end up getting him this set. And I thought this was so cute. Summer vibes. I ended up finding his size. I didn't find it, I couldn't find his size for a while. And then I ended up seeing one more in his size. So um, I think that's all I've got. So that's all I got today um, shopping. So I thought I'd show y'all that haul. It is the next day. We are continuing with this get it all done and getting a lot done today as well. I spent a few hours this morning doing things. First of all, I did a 20-minute ride on my bike. Um, I did not have a lot of time because my alarm did not go off this morning. And so, since it did not go off, 
I decided to do a quick ride because I had just so much other stuff to do and we had plans a little bit later on in the day. So I did a quick ride and I think any kind of workout is better than no workout, even if you do just 10 minutes. Um, so I'm starting in the girls' rooms, or actually the kids' rooms, I should say, because now we have a little boy with his room as well. I'm starting in their rooms, getting them picked up, and doing a pretty good cleaning to them. You see Delaney's artwork on her wall. She loves coloring pictures, and then she'll hang it on her wall. But I'm making up her bed. We really need to get some beddies for her bed as well, but she really loves her bedding and she's asked me not to get her any beddies right now because she just loves the look of her bedding so maybe in the future because it's a lot easier to make up but for now I'm just gonna honor her wish and not <laughs> get her anything else because she just loves it that much she had stuck some stickers on her bed and so I had used something to go ahead and get those off which was really tough to get those stickers off um, so we did have a talk about no more stickers on your bed because it makes a mess. So anyways, I'm getting their rooms picked up and doing a good cleaning to them today. My kids have so many stuffed animals, so many. And Delaney, that is her favorite thing is stuffed animals. If we go out somewhere and we let her pick something out. She's going to pick a stuffed animal. She just loves them so much. And she's got so many of them that I'm just not really sure what to do with them. But she's got a good bit of storage in her room. She's got underneath storage on her bed that she's got some. She's got some like in her little cube right here. And then I just put more in the top of her closet. So I'm trying to just figure out where to store all of them because she just kind of switches out what she likes to play with each day. So I just like to keep them somewhere just to give her options and then I'm going in her little dresser and reorganizing her clothes they were still pretty organized but if I don't do laundry then then Ethan just kind of throws them in there and doesn't try to keep it as organized as I do so it wasn't that bad because I've been doing a lot of the laundry lately trying to at least and so I was getting that organized and then getting her room vacuumed and then heading to Millie and Ren's room A good clean out of Millie and Rand's room recently like a couple weeks ago and so their room was not that bad and ever since I kind of cleaned it out it has stayed a lot more organized and a lot cleaner but in their beds they love to bring things to bed with them and so I'm constantly having to take things out of their beds because they just rack up so many things in there so that is what I was doing and then making their beds up which their beds are a lot easier than Delaney's to make up So that's why it stays this way. It stays a mess. But I'm going through and hanging some of his clothes up that needed to be hang, hung up, excuse me, um, that we had done laundry. We do his laundry like every few days. So his clothes needs, needed to be put in his closet that we hadn't put up yet. And I'm putting away a few more things of his. In this corner over here, we have kept a lot of our extra diapers. Like we've got some more size ones, which he's in now, and then a lot of size twos. And so I was going through those and putting them in his closet to kind of free up that space over there because we ended up, you'll see in a second, we ended up getting the diaper genie in his room, which has been in Millie and Ren's room, but it don't need to be in there anymore. And so we, for a long time, we wasn't necessarily using his room to change him near as much as we were using mine and Ethan's room. And so we change him a lot more in his room now. So we needed to go ahead and move that into his room so we could use that more. We 
doing a mopping to our entire house. I was starting in the girls' rooms and then working our, my way through the rest of the house. This needed this really, really badly. I am really, I know, I know I've mentioned this several times. I'm bad about cleaning my floors regularly, which hasn't been that long since I've cleaned them. Or as I should say a deep cleaning. My floors needed a good deep cleaning today. And so I really wanted to get that done before we head to vacation. And so I, this has sped up really fast um, just because I had my entire house to do. And I'm sure you guys just didn't want to see uh, 10 minutes of just cleaning my floors, although I wish it did take just 10 minutes. Um, but I, that is what I'm doing, just doing a really, really good deep clean into my entire house, my entire floors. When I am mopping my floors and doing a really good deep clean mopping, I empty my bucket and change it out several times. As soon as it starts getting dirty, I will empty it out because I do not like mopping with dirty water. So as soon as it starts getting dirty, I'll change it out. And I changed it out several times for this video. up this voiceover Callan is waking up so I'm gonna go grab him real life over here but I hope you guys enjoyed this video getting it all done with me today I hope it gave you some cleaning motivation to maybe get up and do things around your house that need to get done as well but I hope you guys enjoyed it definitely check out the link below to check out the Roborock H7 and I will see you guys soon in another video bye